Anytime I go into the woods, I just go ahead and provide a narrative in case I die to make it easier for them to figure out what happened. Many minutes into their hike, the girls noticed some caves. Whitney went to explore, urged her friend to get back from the edge, claiming it to be unsafe and fearing for her life. With her face against the rock, that's when the cobra struck. With no climbing knowledge or any gear, the two set off on a perilous journey. 1,000 ton rock smashed Kirsten to death. Freak accident of flooding and irrigation. Water levels would drastically rise, filling the cavern from top to bottom. Within a matter of seconds, the girls died in order to make Kirsten go first to the ledge. Kirsten unwittingly went to the ledge. Unfortunately, I have to follow that up because if they find that and you actually trip in the next five minutes, I am fucked. As was their MO, the girls, again, high and outside after dark. Friends of theirs would say that the two girls were experienced hikers. No, would they? No. No. There's yet another slew of misadventures by the girl, Sandy. It was 8 p.m. when the two girls started to hear the sound of bats, a gentle chirping in the trees. As gentle chirping would end in a bloodbath. Girls were nearly out of the woods, but that's when the killer struck. 